Installing the components. Installing the PMU. Installing the PSUs. Take proper ESD protection measures, for example, wear an ESD wrist strap or a pair of ESD gloves to prevent electrostatic damage to the PMU PSUs. If two PMUs are configured and the ports for monitoring the PMUs are logically on the same bus, the dip switch on the first PMU should be set to 3, and the dip switch on the second PMU should be set to 4. If the ports for monitoring the PMUs are logically on different buses, the settings of the dip switches on the two PMUs are the same. Installing the BBU Checking the dip switches on the WMPT. Installing the WRFUs. Use both hands to install the RFU because it is heavy. The standard handle is bound to the air inlet at the bottom of the RF cabinet. The standard handle is used for removing the RFU during maintenance. Bind the standard handle to the original position after the operation. Installing the battery and corresponding cables. Before installation, set the MCB labeled BAT under the PSU to OFF in case of high current. During installation, the positive and the negative poles of batteries must not be short-circuited. The tools such as wrenches and screwdrivers must be insulated. Otherwise, a burnt battery may cause human injuries. <laughs>